that is if we are increasing the number of stages of the compressor that is a low pressure compressor and a high pressure compressor by means of an intercooler the work utilized by the compressor can be reduced because when we are using in a single layer of compressor due to the high pressure and all high temperature and all we can't uh, it, it can't develop the maximum work that or maximum pressure so by using an intercooler we can reduce the temperature that if, if you are reducing the temperature they can produce its maximum work or the work uh, absorbed from the turbine during its compression process is very low then the low pressure compressor it is absorbing air and is exiting to the intercooler the intercooler here it is the pressure is increasing and the temperature is also increasing E high temperature level in the gas in a intercooler could a cut at the video bomb it in the temperature are reducing but pressure remains pressure remains constant and temperature get reduced in here reduce either temperature constant pressure low line a wind and normal high pressure to compressor load to go to know your high pressure compressor in the wind pressure increase either turn I'm gonna combustion chamber load to go to go then combustion chamber of fuel supply see I'm then during during the supply of fuel the combustion is taking place after that we are giving to the turbine due to this intercooling process the work output work taken from the turbine by the compressor can be reduced let me give in the diagram no come there is ts diagram here is the ts diagram this ts diagram from 1 to 2 it is low pressure compressor 1 to 2 it is low pressure compressor then 2 to 3 is due to intercooling I said that intercooling time in a temperature correct answer that is temperature alim t2 iron no pin is the t3 iron but temperature I would have reduced I at a pressure at this pressure you can say as this is p1 p2 and p3 if it is p1 p2 and p3 at pressure p2 we are doing the intercooling then then the intercooling temperature the temperature reduces in intercooling and again in high pressure compressor here it is high pressure compressor in high pressure compressor that uh, pressure is again increasing from 3 to uh, p2 to p3 then temperature is increasing from 3 to 4 in ideal case again we are adding the term heat that is 4 to 5 we are adding the heat and 5 to 6 it is expanding in the turbine here we are doing the compression process in two stages in a low pressure tower compressor and a high pressure compressor this is a process that is 1 to 2 dash here where i'm going to denote the actual process and denote the 1 to 2 dash 1 to 2 dash in the barnale low pressure compressor anna. then 2 dash to 3 in the barnale intercooling anna. then 3 to 4 dash it is high pressure compressor 4 dash to 5 combustion chamber uh, combustion takes place that is in combustion chamber in 4 5 to 6 dash turbine or expansion on any any blue color which did not take in l and l dash that is intercooling in line in angle i'm going to get another one to l a little one to l dash on the number of compression then i'm going to heat add you know expand you know but if intercooling is there it is here intercooling very much and a low pressure turbine and high pressure turbine not to go into the above here blue color look on chicken it is without intercooling okay then i'm going to work input with intercooling and do it again without intercooling and do it again it is cp into with intercooling and angle work input every day can end the compressor on all other e low pressure low high pressure low up a low pressure low low the cp into t2 dash minus t1 plus cp into t4 dash minus t3 in a without intercooling and angle cp into tl dash minus t1 and get tl dash minus c1 and and i just put here that is t2 dash minus t1 plus tl dash minus t2 into cp I'm going to give it a look on English work input with intercooling work input with intercooling is less than work input without intercooling because without intercooling let them carry on your area no your area no this is 
ഹൈ ദിസ് ഈസ് ലാർജർ ദാൻ ദിസ് ഏരിയ അപ്പോൾ വിത്തൌട്ട് ഇൻ്റർകൂളിംഗ് ആകുമ്പോഴാണ് നമുക്ക് വർക്ക് ഒരുപാട് വേണ്ടത് ഇത് വിത്ത് ഇൻ്റർകൂളിംഗ് ആകുമ്പോൾ വർക്ക് കുറച്ച് മതി ബിക്കോസ് ഈ ഒരു ഫോർ ടു ത്രീ എന്ന ഏരിയ എൽ ടു എൽ ടു എന്ന ഏരിയേനെക്കാളും റെഡ്യൂസ് ആണ് നമുക്കറിയാം വർക്ക് എന്ന് പറഞ്ഞാൽ ഏരിയ അണ്ടർ ദ ഗ്രാഫാണ് സോ ഇത് ക്രിയേറ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്ന ഏരിയ ഈസ് ലെസ് ദാൻ ദ ഏരിയ ക്രിയേറ്റഡ് ബൈ എൽ ടു ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് വർക്ക് ക്രിയേറ്റഡ് ബൈ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് നീഡഡ് വിത്തൌട്ട് ഇൻ്റർകൂളിംഗ് ഈസ് ഗ്രേറ്റർ ദാൻ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് വിത്ത് ഇൻ്റർകൂളിംഗ് ഹിയർ ദ കൺക്ലൂഷൻ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് വിത്ത് ഇൻ്റർകൂളിംഗ് ഈസ് ലെസ് ദാൻ വർക്ക് ഇൻപുട്ട് വിത്തൌട്ട് ഇൻ്റർകൂളിംഗ് ദെൻ വി ആർ ഗോയിങ് ദൻ വർക്ക് റേഷ്യൂ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് നെറ്റ് വർക്ക് ഔട്ട്പുട്ട് ഡിവൈഡ് ബൈ ഗ്രോസ് വർക്ക് ഔട്ട്പുട്ട് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് വർക്ക് റേഷ്യൂ ഈസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വർക്ക് ഓഫ് എക്സ്പാൻഷൻ മൈനസ് വർക്ക് ഓഫ് കമ്പ്രഷൻ ബൈ വർക്ക് ഓഫ് എക്സ്പാൻഷൻ here it is heat supplied with intercooling heat supplied with intercooling is cp into t5 minus t4 and heat supplied without intercooling is cp into t5 minus t l dash here it is without intercooling this much heat and with intercooling this much heat that is decrease in heat supply due to intercooling intercooling varumo namaku supply cheyanda heat valare koravana that is thermal efficiency is increasing this is uh, this is about intercooling techniques used to increase the efficiency of the turbine another method to improve the efficiency of the thermal efficiency of the gas turbine is reheating here in reheating we are using two levels of turbine that is high pressure turbine and a low pressure turbine in a compressor the air is entering and the compressed air is entering to the combustion chamber and the hot gas is first expanding in the high pressure turbine in this high pressure turbine the compressor is extracting the power to work and again from this high pressure turbine it is again passing through a combustion chamber a fuel is again injected here then the hot gas is again expanded in the low pressure turbine and is exhausted here from the high pressure turbine only the compressor is extracting the power this is a ts diagram of the reheating section that is from 1 to 2 it is compressed that is ideal one 1 to 2 dash is actual one from 2 to 3 dash it is combustion chamber 1 it is combustion chamber 1 it is adding the heat then 3 to 4 e high pressure turbine will expand in nana 3 to 4 that is 3 to 4 nu vannal ideal one nu 3 to 4 dash nu vannal actual one nu again oru combustion chamber il vechu veendum nammal burn cheyana that is cc2 combustion chamber 2 ee oru combustion chamber il heat team veendum namukku endu cheyana avada temperature increase cheyana t4 dash il ninnum t5 lote temperature increase cheyidu then again ad expand cheyunu in the low pressure turbine 5 to 6 is ideal and 5 to 6 dash is actual one ivide low pressure turbine and net work output with the reheating ennu parnale namukku ariyam ivide gas um undavum then air um undavum ee ivide enter cheyna air um ivide ivide enter cheyna gas um aanu here it is air and here it is gas here it is air okay appo net work output with reheating la first one cpg into t5 minus t5 t6 dash t5 minus t6 dash that is net work output with reheating reheating ullapo idana namukku kittuna net work output because high pressure turbine inda create cheyna output ennu parnal it is we are utilizing in a compressor compressor na work cheyanana high pressure turbine la use cheyna then low pressure turbine la undavuna power mathrame namukku output aayittu kittullu that is net work output with reheating that is cpg into t5 minus t6 dash ini idu റീഹീറ്റിംഗ് ഇല്ലാതെയാണെങ്കിലോ റീഹീറ്റിംഗ് ഇല്ലാതെയാണെങ്കിൽ നമുക്ക് എന്ത് ചെയ്യാണ് സി പി ജി ഇൻറ്റു ടി ഫോർ ഡാഷ് മൈനസ് ടി എൽ ഡാഷ് ദിസ് വൺ ടി ഫോർ ഡാഷ് മൈനസ് ടി എൽ ഡാഷ് വിത്തൌട്ട് റീഹീറ്റിംഗ് റീഹീറ്റിംഗ് ഇല്ലാതെ വരുവാണെങ്കിൽ നമുക്ക് ഇത് മാത്രമാണ് ഔട്ട്പുട്ട് വരുന്നത് ടി ഫോർ മൈനസ് ടി എൽ ഡാഷ് ഇനി ഈ ഹൈ പ്രഷർ ഞാൻ നേരത്തെ പറഞ്ഞ പോലെ ഹൈ പ്രഷർ ടർബൈനിലെ എത്രയാണോ വർക്ക് ക്രിയേറ്റ് ചെയ്യുന്നത് അത് നമ്മൾ എന്ത് ചെയ്യാണ് കമ്പ്രസറിൽ യൂസ് ചെയ്യണം ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് സി പി എ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് സി പി ഓ
into t3 dash minus t1 is equal to cpg into t3 minus t4 dash. That is reheating increase the net work output because high pressure turbine le use in the compressor le use in the namka low pressure le down the low pressure turbine le use in the moon we can make net work out tighter produce here much also heat supplied in the one another heat supplied is cpg into t3 minus t2 dash cpg into cpg into t3 minus t2 dash if it in compressor le namal heat supply in the if it in supply in that is cpg into T3 minus T2 dash plus CPG into T5 minus T4 dash. Here it is. That is by means of reheating, we can increase the net work output of the uh, gas turbines. We know that efficiency is equal to output by input, net work output divided by heat supplied. So, heat supplied already number generate kitty uh, tender. Reheating the work output increase but obviously the efficiency will also increase. Then we are going to next section that is regeneration. Regeneration here it is. Compressor la compressor in the air number two heat exchanger over here pass it over So even down the high temperature, high pressure air la your temperature heat exchanger absorb in the the temperature is absorbing from this exhaust gas to the this section. If we down the pressure and down the high pressure down the gas, high temperature in the combustion chamber. This combustion chamber will burn up by the hot gas is given to the turbine. Then this turbine and exhaust gas will open up the atmosphere and then we will pass the heat to the heat exchange. So, the exhaust gas will also be absorbed in the temperature and the inlet will be absorbed in the inlet. Okay, it increases the, so at the same temperature, we can increase the heat supply, so we can increase the efficiency of the gas turbine. This is the diagram, TS diagram, 1 to 2, it is compressing, that is 1 to 2 dash actual system, 2 dash to 4, it is, uh, heat is adding, then 4 to 5 dash, it is expanding, again, we have 5 dash and 6 in them, heat extracting, this is the last one. This is a regeneration. Then the regeneration effectiveness is increase in enthalpy per kg of air divided by available increase in enthalpy per kg of air. Namka e extraction karnam etriana increase in enthalpy divided by actual at etra kitumairunu. Because e heat takes in the ilar and etra kitumairunu divide an output input then increase in enthalpy is the input efficiency is t3 minus t2 dash divided by t5 dash minus t2 dash these are the these three uh, methods to improve the efficiency of open cycle gas turbines in a constant pressure classification thank you